Hello, boys and girls, my name is Atsuki, and welcome back to season 39 of my FTL series here in the uh, Slug Crucial Layout C, where we had a dive last time. Uh, we took a bit of, of damage. And the thing here is we cannot risk uh, l any crew member to die before we have repaired the uh, clone bay. Afterwards, it's not really a big issue because we can clone them back. <coughs> yep, just like this. And what we now actually need is a bit of scrap and an, an opportunity to repair. Okay, we got our crew back. Uh, cloning, unfortunately, means they lose a bit of their uh, uh, skill level. But it's better than uh, losing the crew member altogether. Don't have to scrap, so sorry. Uh, we will fight the ship if necessary. Nice. Now we got uh, a map of the complete sector where we can see where uh, potential fights are. But let's go to this store as we need a repair. Okay, that's all we can afford. And then go here and pick ourselves a fight. <clears throat> we now come across two um, Two shield ships. Which can be a bit um, daunting. Okay, at least their flag is down. One shield is down. Okay, shield is completely down. And they're gone. Nice. And it's a double reward. Um, which means we can have one more power for our uh, engines there. And go up here. What do we have? Asteroid. Okay, asteroids are not so bad. Ooh, an automated ship. They have mind control, but we can use our mind control to counter that. Uh, especially um, seeing that on this ship, um, we there is no crew that we could mind control. They do have a bit of evasion. All right. 
And they're gone. All right, then we move on to here. Okay, they have this uh, anti-ship drone and a shield recharger, which means um, having a uh, Hacking there is not optimal. Let's use that to bring down their uh, shield every once in a while. Okay, that got us somewhere. One hit. Damn it! Ah, oh, that's not good. This could take a while, or this could end badly. Okay, we got one hit in there. Crew member down. What would be good is if we were able to shoot down the uh, shield overcharger. Or the other drone. Because then we can do this. Ok, 
Okay, the overcharger is down. No surrender. They are gone. Okay, we do have a bit of uh, repairs to do, so let's get to it. And we survived this fight. And we have to decide if we want to invest more into weapons. Uh, we do have the weapon or if we should go the shield way. Um, however, I think as we might come across three uh, shield ships, let's upgrade here. Because hacking too gives us a chance to beat them. Okay, that brought down a good chunk of their weapons. And they're gone. More goodies. Ooh, there is a rebel ship there. Yeah. No surrender for you. And they are gone. So we took a bit of damage, and, uh, which indicates maybe we should invest in uh, the next shield level. Also having uh, one more weapon level there would help, it would prevent uh, our uh, weapons constantly going down. So let's see what we need. Weapon would be 50 for the shield, 100 plus power, so let's have this here then we go over here Ooh. 
Ooh, analysis and easy ship. Hull beam is down. And they're gone. And we get five hull points repaired. We can move on to here. Or we will intervene defending the outpost. Um, focus on their weapons. This is a hull laser mark 2 that shoots two shots plus then the uh, iron cannon which can be damaging but as long as they miss it's not so bad There they go. More scrap, more scrap. We move on to here. And to the exit. Uh, we will attack the rebels. They have a missile. Only one should. We don't need um, hacking here, but the defense drone can help us out here quite a bit. Let's focus on weapons first. Okay, that got the flag down. And hopefully the defense drone can deal with, um, with the missiles. That got the uh, shield done and they have a fire in there. Also have a fire in there, and they're gone. Okay, maybe that was not the brightest idea, but we are once again over 100 scrap, and we need 100 for the shield. Plus then, of course, the the power. But we do have two to spare, at the moment. But we will see how it goes in the next sector, which will be slug controlled nebula. Until then, goodbye.